So who are the DITC? Um, for us, I think the DITC is the community. Um, drone instructors love an analogy. So, you know, the DITC is the choir and, um, you know, they're all in charge of their own instruments. And, you know, it, you've got Ian and myself who are kind of compiling them and getting the sheet music together and the scenery and just looking for the opportunities and the possibilities. As a starting point, we've teamed up with Go Roadie, with Go Roadie who are a directory company based in Scotland, who showed genuine concern and support for driving instructors during lockdown. Barry and Michael are decent chaps and we'll be providing the support behind the membership system, allowing us to keep the collective informed. So you might see Go Roadie mentioned in certain places on the receipts and invoices, or you might see it mentioned on emails. Um, they're just here because they're helping us to build the platform so that we can best get the information out and best manage the system. And they're really good at the GDPR stuff as well. So it makes sure that the, the membership details and everything's locked GDPR. away. We love GDPR. That's why they're doing it for us. Um, <laughs> the GDPR, get someone else in. Um, so, yeah. So, you know, what we want to do is we, we want to champion causes. Um, we want to team up with some experts in, in, in their fields. And, and just give people points of guidance. So, you know, the, the disability specialists. Um, I've been doing some, some things during lockdown with um, uh, Vicky Ambrose, who's doing British Sign Language. Hello, um, and I've been trying to, trying to, you know, learn a bit of that. And that's as far as I've got, but I'm working on it. She's great. She's, Somebody. yeah. Um, and, uh, you know, so we're trying to do things like that and, and team up with people. Um, and we, you know, you, our, our First Lady of Wales, hopefully will be heading those Welsh questions because hasn't COVID, you know, lockdown, the, the Welsh and Scottish instructors have really been left to their own devices. Yeah, we, we're, we're still in lockdown at the minute in Wales. Yeah, yeah still um, struggling along. Um, in fact, I think it's tomorrow. No, sorry, it's Monday today, Wednesday. There's um, a big kind of convoy convoy up to the centers to um saw that yeah kind of protest um yeah. just to show that there's been such lack of kind of support for driving instructors in wales we're still uh, unaware of anything um i had a tweet back from the welsh government this afternoon not long before i started chatting with you guys actually that said that um i'd asked for clarification on if driving lessons could be done if you weren't a key worker in Wales. Now, I'm pretty certain the guidelines are showing that lessons are suspended, but I know there's a lot of kind of, oh, I don't know, it doesn't the confusion. Happen, it's not allowed. Um, yeah. So I asked for clarification and they don't really clarify. They've just said, um, you know, we're working on driving lessons, giving some information as soon as possible. I just need a yes or no. Yeah. And when that information is so hard to come by, and, and Scotland's the same, I was talking to yeah, a Scottish instructor yesterday, and when that information is so hard, even when we get it, the instructor network is awful mm -hmm. about trying to, trying to spread that message. So, you know, that's what we want to be part of, is, is that community, that collective of instructors that are going to pass the message on and are going to share that correct information. And I think that's really important. It's also about providing clarity as well and making sure that one message is being put out and we can reinforce that message from lots of different sources as well. And so people can know it's information they can trust, which I think is more important than anything at the moment. I think the model that we're trying to follow is the, um, the Martin Lewis, uh, the money saving expert who really, you know, shone during, during lockdown, um, helped so many people trying to figure out what the hell they were doing about money situation and you know um, loans and mortgages and that's the kind of model that we're looking at is is that for driving instructors so that inside of the industry there's that if I need to look something up I go straight to their website and it, it's easy to look, work through and then I get my monthly email through that is headlines it's not the in-depth stuff but if you want to read the in-depth stuff, there'll be links available so that you can read what's relevant to you, what interests you as and, well. 
And I think we're, we're aiming for those kind of two minute reads. We're looking for um, trying to shorten down the big story. Yeah. So, you know, your bullet point stuff. And if you want to go deeper and we're, we're hoping to include anything that we put together, we're going to try and include a, a, a timestamp as to how long it will roughly take you. So if you've got five minutes before a pupil um, and there's a 10 minute story, you know, you're not going to fit it in. But if you, if it's a, a quick, you know, three minute read, you know, you can, hopefully people will, will get what they need. Then.